Hey guys, I've been pondering this question and I think I came up with an answer based on some past studies I did when I was putting together my Sanctified Sexuality course. In that course, I learned that girl babies are girl babies because of uh, the hormone estrogen. And then male babies have a testosterone bath at about probably 13 weeks, I believe. They have another one when they're about 13 years old. It literally disconnects a lot of their nerve connections or their neural pathways, making them more compartmentalized. For females, we have a higher developed emotional uh, awareness as well as empathy. And we're very communicative versus a lot of men. Not saying men can't be, it's just we tend to be more so. And so what happens is we care about what people think in a way that can really um, hurt us at times if we're not careful. So here's the question. So my question was, why is it harder for women to sell? And the reason it's harder for women to sell is because of how our brains are. So all the things that are good of being empathic, of being good communicators, all of that stuff become overextended and become a weakness because we're like, I don't want to be that person that sells, you know, that sells it to them or that's pushy. Uh, I don't want them to think bad about me. I don't want to offend them. Uh, you know, I don't want to, uh, you know, make them uncomfortable. So all of those things that we normally do then stop us from selling our product or service. So I'm just going to straight up tell you, I am damn proud of my product, my course. It has helped me and it has helped so many other people and I am proud of it. And so I have learned that because I'm passionate about it and because I'm so proud of it, that it's easier for me, but I still have those thoughts that come up in my head and make me hesitant. So, quick tip, selling is not selling. Selling is listening, understanding, and solving problems. It is the art of persuasion, which is another thing women are really good at doing. You just ask your kiddos and they will tell you. So, I want you to think of it that way, that you are persuading through relationship someone to buy your product or service because you know it's life-changing and life-transforming. So I know this is a little long, but I just had to talk about this with you.